Managers are a mad, mad bunch. If they're not devising innovative tactics, they're responding to being accidentally hit with a football in a calm and collected manner. You try kicking the goal, you hit me? That's some f***ing brains, didn't you? <laughs> but what have these mad managers been up to this week? <laughs> Ah. Well, how about Graham Wesley, a man who for some reason decided to give up his long-term job at Stevenage, a team he guided to promotion from the conference to League One and who currently sit in the playoff places, to take up a job at Preston North End. Wesley and everybody's favourite bird, Peter Risdale. You, you know Peter Risdale, right? I'm happy to stick my CV up against anybody else's in football. I'm delighted that the last seven months here have seen yet another successful outcome for Peter Risdale. Of course you do. Well, they've been turning things around up there in the grim north with a great run of results. And by great run, I mean a loss to Leighton Orient and a ball draw away to Notts County. Anyway, Wesley clearly has a definite style, that style being be a weird and slightly rubbish manager. He sent a text to his team the night before a game at 2am, naming the starting lineup and saying, My aim is my next medal. My aim is my next win. My commitment is every ounce of sweat, brain and blood. You what? Meanwhile, referee shoving Paolo Di Canio seems to have finally cracked down at Swindon Town. Di Canio gave one of his players a boot up the arse and was then sent to the stands by the referee as the Robins beat Macclesfield 1-0. After the game, he had this to say. I have a culture. I don't stop my culture. I speak with my body language sometimes. And even if I'm in England, the English people, English referee, have to respect me. You move too much of the arms. I do what I want in the technical area if I call my player. Send me off. Every game, no problem. I will win this league anyway.